What's up, Internet? It's Josh Hewitt, and once again, it it's is time, time to do it with you. Back with another mad triad, this time for biceps, where we take three exercise variations and progress from one to the other, starting with the hardest, moving down to the easiest. So you can use the same weight to continue performing repetitions once you hit fatigue, just by changing the angle of the exercise. So with this one, we're starting with an incline bicep curl. Make sure you come all the way down to a full stretch with about a 45 degree angle on the bench and then squeeze at the top while supinating or turning the palms upward at the top of each repetition and contracting hard. Once you do hit fatigue, flip around so you're face down on the bench and let your arms hang straight down. Curl both arms so the dumbbells come up towards the sides of your head and again supinate at the top of each repetition so that your palms are facing straight upward. You should feel an intense squeeze at the top of each repetition. Try not to swing the weight. Make sure you're using strict control, especially on the eccentric or the negative phase of each repetition. Try to turn your pinkies inwards towards your ears. So really turn those palms up and inwards. Squeeze as hard as you can at the top and really control the stretch on the way down. Force out as many reps as you can and then finish off with standing dumbbell curls. Now you can again supinate at the top of each repetition or you could perform hammer curls with a neutral grip if you wanted to really hit that brachialis and bring out those forearms. So this hits the biceps from all different angles from the fully stretched position as well as a shortened position and the neutral curls like this. You're going to get a great bicep to work out in a solid pump. Give this exercise a shot and let me know what you think. Until next time, stay strong. So once I reach complete fatigue with the triceps head cavers, I'm going to switch to a pullover tricep extension. So I'm going to reach back behind my head, get a full stretch of the triceps, and then extend fully over my chest.